everyone, welcome to a new video and welcome back to my channel. Stray Kids are back and I got the opportunity to see them uh, at Music Bank in Paris this April. I went there as press to cover the festival and it was my first time seeing them in four years. Like I got to see and meet them for the first time uh, during their first uh, European tour. And as we all know, they were gonna come back to Europe, right? But then COVID-19 happened. And since then, we have been waiting for them to announce uh, dates, European dates. It hasn't happened yet. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that, that makes me sad because, you know, I need a full Stray Kids concert. As I said, I had uh, the opportunity to see them again at Music Bank in Paris, but um, I need a full Stray Kids concert. Like, it's, it's been so long, right? Since the first time I saw and meet them. It was in Paris as well. And Chan said that they are gonna go everywhere with their next tour. I'm trusting you, Chan. <laughs> Please don't... <laughs> Don't break my heart again because it's been too long and we need Stray Kids in Europe. Uh, I don't know if they will come to Spain. I'm hoping that they will because they were gonna come with their tour before COVID-19. So yeah, I'm hoping, we are hoping that they will come. But we'll see. <laughs> back to what we are here for today. Uh, Stray Kids are coming back and I need to say that when I watched the music video teasers, I was like, okay, this feels like uh, God's Menu, Thunderous and Case 143 had a child, if that makes sense. It kind of feels like a mix of those concepts and aesthetics and I'm so here for it. I feel like they are doing a mix of their past comics and this is going to be very interesting. So, uh, without further ado, this is called S Class. Let's go. Okay. 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 Ooh. Best of the best on first class. Okay. This has been stuck in my head. It feels <laughs> like five songs in one. This part. Oh! <laughs> He's like, don't care what's going on. The most special star that's me. The way you're not scared <laughs> of announcing that they are the best. We are for we are here for this confident. Mm. 
I thought Okay, that transition. And this is why I love them. <laughs> the music video. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> you know, no... Not everyone, I would say, no one can pull off this the way they do. The way the music video... And, I mean, the song feels like five different songs in one. And the music video feels like... <laughs> a, a mix of things that you would think don't go together, but they make it work. I mean, <laughs> there were many things going on and I love how it also felt like different music videos in one. That's why I said like no one can pull off this the way they do. Like Stray Kids aren't for everyone. And what I mean with this is that they are challenging the audience with every single comeback and every single release, if that makes sense. Because they are not afraid of experimenting and doing new and different things. And they are not afraid of like the response, if that makes sense. They are doing them, right? They are, they know who they are and they are staying true to themselves and they are so unapologetically themselves every single time. They really don't care like it's like this is who we are if you like it great and if you don't it's fine we, we don't really care <laughs> they are selecting the audience because they know they aren't for everyone but they know they are the best i love the lyrics every single time this confidence they have like we are the best we are not for everyone and that's fine because that makes us a five star group in a sense, I feel like what they are doing by being unapologetically themselves and just doing what they want without caring if people actually like it or not, because they like it, they are experimenting with their sound and they are uh, putting out there the music they feel they want to do. And they know only people who vibe with them, only people who truly understand them, their lyrics and their sound and their concept will stay by their side. You know, it's, it's like selecting, as I said. <laughs> Hold on, let's rewind and let's analyze a little bit more. Like, first the whistling. Oh. Oh. Feeling fire. Already three different sounds. And yet another one. Another one. The transitions though, and the music video editing. I love the different aesthetics. This is my favorite part. The different aesthetics and concepts. It's a weird mix that works. And it's so straight. It's. And yet another sound! Eat. 
the lyrics though. First class indeed. <laughs> and there's also this comedy fact. <laughs> like, wait, what's going on? They are so big brain for this. And yet no the sound. Uh, Mino with the Barrett. Every single time. I thought my computer froze. Okay. Like, they are so good, man. Oh! The first time, I was so focused because so many things were going on. I'm, I'm vibing now more. Because I'm not as confused. <laughs> like, I already know what happens. Although there are, like, many details and, and many, 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 many things that I would need to keep <laughs> discovering while watching it more. But, like, the first time I was so confused, I was, like, speechless. I was like, so many things are going on, you gotta focus. And now I was, like, more like, you know, I'm gonna enjoy it this and vibe yeah definitely many things are going on like we have an alien and and they don't really care <laughs> maybe there is a metaphor like as i said they don't really care what people say or what or what's going on around them they are doing themselves and if you like it good and if you don't also good so maybe that's what it signifies i don't know or maybe it's it's all in my head. Who knows? There are different universes, I would say. And it's like a mix of their past comebacks. And, and also a mix of their sounds. Oh! Mm, interesting. And there's like this war with, with an alien. Like we can see Songmin just listening to music, vibing and dancing. While the alien is like destroying everything around him and and he doesn't even realizes it's like okay what's going on he doesn't care and then we see it again like the war against the alien but then we see Hyunjin just sitting like all calm and the lyrics go like we don't need an audience for the festival this is definitely has something to do with their sound and like uh, what people talk about them. Like, we don't really care. You know, we, you all are fighting out there, but we remain unbothered. Like, we don't care. This is not our fight. This is not our war because we are doing our music the way we feel it. And we like it. We enjoy it. We are having fun. You are the ones who have the problem. And you are the ones who are making an unnecessary fight and war. I mean, it makes sense in my head. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, now I like it even more. <laughs> So that was everything for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like it. And if you did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Bye bye.